everyone and welcome back to my channel if you're new here I'm Mary and I make regular reaction review and gaming videos so if you haven't already push that subscribe button and don't forget to turn on notifications so you never miss a video from my channel and the uncut version of this video along with so much more can be found over on patreon link is in the description bar below for that as well as my new channel Fairy Cherry where the content may vary but it's still the same old Mary Cherry now today I'm watching a film that I have actually never heard of in my entire life but it was released in 1991 it's called Rocketeer. It's an action-adventure, sci-fi, family, superhero film. So a lot of different elements going on over here. And it is set during World War II. It's based on a comic book and it's apparently a classic. So I'm pretty excited to get into this one, especially because a lot of people really enjoy this movie. So without further ado, let's get watching. I like the music. It's very triumphant already. This gentleman, who I'm assuming is the main character, is pretty good looking. He reminds me a little bit of um, a mix of Brendan Fraser and Zane, Billy Zane, in a way, I think. Gosh, check out those old cars. Authorized persons own, personnel only. Do, do, do. Oh, he's above it all. Oh, shit. He's He's being shot at! Uh-oh! Emergency landing! Emergency landing! Oh fuck, yeah. That's a- that's a good idea. He's pretty strong. I feel like if I tried to punch the window, I'd get hurt more <laughs> than the window. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think. Okay, so whatever's in that suitcase is clearly of high value not even not even grieving his friend for a second just up and up and go uh oh uh oh uh oh oh shit oh my god oh my god let's just hope it doesn't go oh shit i was literally just gonna okay oh my god uh, somebody... Is there... Is, do fire ex extinguishers exist in 1938? I don't know. <laughs> oh, Walk away, walk away, it's gonna blow. Man, I love what they used to wear. I wish people would dress like this today. <laughs> mm. Maybe it's time to get a real job. What? Oh! Oh shit! Isn't that the feds? Elsie? Take it easy, dude. That's that's authority, man. What do we tell the president? Yeah, tell him go to hell. Hughes, nineteen thirty-eight. Rocket. Howard Hughes. He's a famous aviator, dude. I've seen the movie Aviator. I'm pretty sure it's about him, and he went crazy in the end. Oh shit, did I? Did I spoil it? Is he serious? Is that where this film is going? He's gonna be a clown? <laughs> that was a bit unexpected. Oh, he really loves that girl. The hell? What's the, what the heck? How random. Oh, she... It's a jetpack. He put it in his plane. And everybody else thinks it's dead. Kaput. Oh! Ah! Damn! Good God! Uh, turn it off. Jesus. It's fucking powerful, let me tell ya. Some high-tech shit for the 30s. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is insane. Imagine finding a jetpack. Like, holy shit. <laughs> I'd be flying everywhere. Now where's the package? 
Nothing's gonna happen with me and my boys until you tell me exactly why this merchandise is so important to the feds. Man, everybody wants a jet pack. He's gonna walk into the hospital with a smile on his face and a handful of posies. He's gonna charm the feds to death. <laughs> 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 this guy has such a particular face. With the creepiest smile as well. <laughs> Whoa. Who does he think he is? Enigo Montonia? <laughs> and he's a movie star. <laughs> yeah, what does he want a jetpack for? That's the statue they stole earlier. Holy, holy, holy heck. It works. It works very well. Uh, wouldn't your butt get really hot? Oh my god. Oh fucking hell. No way in hell that just happened. That is probably worth a million bucks. And they just lost it because they were testing. You'd be halfway to Kansas by now, you chowderhead. <laughs> chowderhead. <laughs> I haven't heard anyone say that in a really long time. Oh wait, there it is. It's behind them. It's got to run out of alcohol eventually. Oh, fuck. <laughs> why, did we, why are they running that way? Just like fucking that way. God, it's so loud. Besides, the feds are mixed up in this. I don't want to keep it. I, I just want to borrow it for a while. Oh, my God. This is going to be a bad idea, dude. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, you do, but... <laughs> And probably something to protect your ass, man. Oh, is this this girl from the photo? Oh my gosh, that's the young Jennifer Connelly. Damn. I've only ever seen her older, but my goodness. No gentleman after 6 p.m. Well, I'm no gentleman. You don't say that again. <laughs> I'm a bloody scoundrel. Oh, there's the, there's the injured dude. <laughs> Man, such simple days. <laughs> Listening to the radio and just having the best time of your life. <laughs> okay, this guy's face is really scary. Oh, he's wearing a mask. Or is that his face? Oh, oh, he looks villainous. Ooh. The rocket. Oh my god. He's like a comic book villain. I got the package stashed real good. It's at the airfield. Hangar three. It's in some old plane. Oh shit. One person knows where the jetpack is now. Once in a while it wouldn't hurt to try someplace new. Maybe away from the airfield. Do you know what? It's so funny the amount of movies I watch. Where couples are like this. <laughs> you said there were a few bumps. <laughs> Boy, I'll say. She folded like a kite when she hit the runway. We thought old Clippy's number was up. What with the fire? Uh oh. Uh oh. Don't. Don't. Oh, don't. Oh! oh shit. She knows. I understand I'm making you happy. Just like the last time when I flew the regional. You got a big part. You stood behind Myrna Loy with a bowl of grapes. Oh my god, that's rude. Good night, Millie. Thank you for the suit. God, he's condescending. Yeah, what I was going to say about couples in movies is, like, the girl's always wanting to try new things and the guy's always just, like, comfortable all the time, just, like, just happy and content just doing the same thing every day. <laughs> and the girl's like, oh, come on, let's just do something new. <laughs> like, every movie. <laughs> She hangs around with this Hollywood crowd all day talking about movie stars and nightclubs. So what? That's her work. She don't care about them phony baloney. She cares about you. <laughs> phony baloney. You got a good thing going on with that girl, Clifford. But if she flies the coop, I'm telling you right now, it's going to be your fault. <laughs> well, what do you know about women, Peeve? <laughs> yeah, had a date since 1932. So six years ago. There's no point in dating nobody after her. Oh. 
no further questions, I guess. <laughs> I was like, oh, Laura Maxwell. Okay, that's it. Just Flora Maxwell. <laughs> Damn. You've got to be kidding. That is some dark Vader looking ass helmet. <laughs> what? Kill me as I stand? I thought you were a sporting man. What movie is this? My legend on a film such as you. What is this? Is he an actor playing the role of Inigo Montonio? <laughs> <gasps> oh, what? That was that was Jennifer Connelly's line. They replaced her. What the fuck? She sucks. Give it to Jennifer Connelly. Oh, he's here for her. Ugh, that was still bad. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh no! Oh, Jesus! Oh, that's bad. Excuse me, I'm, I'm looking for Jenny Blake. Oh my god. Jenny, Jenny Blake. Oh my god. I, why would he say that? She's gonna get fired now. <laughs> oh, dude, don't talk so loud. Uh-oh, uh-oh. <gasps> oh my gosh, that's important. What's this? Pay voucher. The director wants you off the picture. You know this oh. is set. I have to go. Come on, come oh. on. You know what Man, that is fucking rough. You must be. Oh. Jenny Blake. Oh my goodness, she's so beautiful when she cries. You read for the part of the Saxon princess. <laughs> no. I think you might be rather wonderful in the role. I'll see that you well, do. Why is he calling the shots? He's just an actor. I've got a regular Mr. Neville. Mr. Neville. <laughs> Neville. <laughs> That's nice. I hope she doesn't move on to this guy, though. He's a fucking asshole. Turn it inside out and upside down. You keep your eyes open for this thing. She might be the one who knows where this guy is who found our package, all right? Okay, yeah, oh my gosh. Everything is surrounding this poor girl now. And there he goes. Hey, the cliff's, cliff's right here. He ain't doing the clown show. Thanks a lot, Bigelow. I'm two minutes late. Who'd you put up in this? <laughs> who is it? It's the program. That's got to be Malcolm up there. Oh my. He hasn't been behind the stick in 25 years. What's he doing up there? He's trying to save your job, Cliff. But if he drifts into those race lanes, he's going to kill somebody. Oh, no. Oh, no. Malcolm, why? <sighs> Rockets in the tool chest, right? Yeah. Uh-oh. <laughs> that could be a big problem, that's why. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, uh, well, I guess we had your food there for a minute. Oh my god, what the heck? How unprofessional. <laughs> what are you doing? Look like oh my gosh, he's gonna save the day. Oh my god, he's an idiot, man. A little luck. <laughs> He looks so funny. <laughs> oh my god. Jesus. Holy shit. Oh my god. This is going to be all over the news. He's not safe. I'm getting it. I don't know what it is, but I'm getting it. Yep. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> what the heck? Why did he think this plan was going to work? He's unconscious. Oh my god. Oh my. Use the jetpack! 
Shut up, dude! You don't know what you're talking about! <laughs> the green screen is pretty good for 91. Oh! Oh my god, this made me so nervous. Oh. Oh my god! He literally just saved Malcolm's life. Oh, he is in trouble now. <laughs> Hopefully, uh, it gives the clown show a lot more money. <laughs> and I think it's gonna be a long, long time. Da -na 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 -na. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> He's such an amateur, it's hilarious. Oh my god. He has been super lucky a lot of time. Oh my f fuck's sakes. <laughs> yeah, just disrupt the whole neighborhood, why not? Oh good, good, get in the water, perfect. <laughs> he definitely needs to work on his landing. Cliff's always getting himself into trouble. <laughs> You like it, huh? Phew, uh -oh, yeah. I don't think it's the news boys. Oh, fuck. Oh! Oh! Oh my god, there's one way. Oh shit, somebody murdered him. It's been folded in half. Oh! Looks like he was writing something. He was folded in half? Who the fuck does that? Um, Palm Terrace. Oh no. This is where Cliff lives. Dude, do a runner, man. You don't know who you're dealing with. Oh no, come on dude, get in there! Oh, break the door, break the door! Oh, oh, fuck this guy's scary as heck! Oh, what's with his face? Don't tell me that's his real face, that's not a real face. Yes, go Peavy! Oh, oh my god, you're gonna break that man's back. Mm. Where is it? Oh, ugh. His mouth doesn't even look like it's probably talking. And I can see that he is the one that folded that guy in half. Uh. Oh my gosh. This is... This is bad. Stay down, dude. Oh, God. It's just completely destroying their house. <gasps> oh, shit. <laughs> Can't lose your hat. Oh, my God. Been outnumbered. Is he gonna peace out of the house with his jetpack? Oh, and she's got a new man on her hand. WC Field. Oh my god. The, what a dickhead. Oh, don't look after her, please. Ew. Gross dude. If the feds get me, I'm taking you with me. I want to tell them everything. Who do you think they'd believe? A cheap crook? Number three box office star in America. Number three. <laughs> Only number three. You call the FBI. We get rid of this damn thing. PV, the FBI's gonna lock us up. They think we were shooting at them. What do you think was going on at the house? We don't got a house, Clifford. We got a gazebo. <laughs> and the FBI and that King Kong gonna get ourselves killed. King Kong gentlemen. <laughs> he is uh, not humanly. Not human like, I should say. Yeah, so? They killed him. Claire! Oh what's going on? 
I'll make the call. People are dying over this fucking rocket. It's not worth it. FBI Los Angeles, Aiken Marsby. Oh, uh, yeah. I, I, I'll be home soon, honey. I love you too. Okay, wife. <laughs> <laughs> We're looking for a pilot by the name of uh, Cliff Secord. Does anybody here know him? I hadn't seen him around. We, uh, we need a pilot <laughs> for a real Secord. Oh, yeah, I know him. Short fella. Gimpy leg. Didn't he move to Cincinnati? <laughs> Love the loyalty. How about you? Listen, friend. We told you. We don't know where he is. Uh, okay, Pop. Maybe we can refresh him. No! Oh, God! Talk, Dad, or get a facial. Drop dead, you weasel! Uh -huh. <laughs> God, I love... God, I love this old man. I told you! Jenny. Jenny. Look at here, boys. Oh. Lady Luck left her phone number. <gasps> uh oh. He's fucking worried now. Cliff Secord. Oh, is that right? <laughs> well, tell him he's too late because she's gone to the South Seas Club with Mr. Neville Sinclair. Oh, she. Oh my gosh. Jeff, you and Mikey stay here and watch who walks into this. Boys, been a pleasure. I'll close him the club. Hi. Oh, at least they're fucked out of this place. All right, everybody. Most of them, anyway. Take it easy. Oh. That's quite a dish you got there. Hey, wait a minute. That's Lady Luck. Oh, 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 oh shit! He put two and two together. But it was too late. <laughs> oh my god. I love this no, duo. Oh God, no! Pete, I'm sorry. I should have listened to you from the start. But Jenny's in trouble now, and that girl means more to me than. I love her, Pete. Oh, she know that? she's with another man, dude. You better. Sorry. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You're leaking like a sieve here. You must have picked up a ricochet. Oh shit! Oh shit! I could have had a couple hours. Oh no! Come on, we need something quick. Let's see if her luck's still holding. Come on. Wow. I would try and secure it a little bit more. <gasps> oh, look here. It's the extraordinary way your face catches the light. Wow. He's really charming her. Got the most scariest, evilest eyes. Man, I feel bad for him. He's about to see his woman dancing with another man. Holy shit. And just like that, he won Jenny. <laughs> Honestly, like, I can see why she'd be so tempted, but this is still fucked. <laughs> Rich, charming, famous, also doesn't just take her to the same place every single night. <laughs> Cliff's not boring, but he doesn't include her in any of the action. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy here we go oh no please don't don't kiss or anything and he already said that he loves her that's got a sting yeah he flies racing planes like this one oh she's given a little too much info he was almost killed It was no. <laughs> I don't know why the real pilots even let him fly. <laughs> At least I'm beginning to feel a bit better about the competition. <laughs> oh, this is so awkward. You worked here long. Oh, yeah. I waited on you last time. <laughs> <laughs> He's being so weird. <laughs> Where was he? <laughs> He's probably hatching some. Now it's an engine. Says you strap it on your back and. Oh. Oh. Will you just excuse me for a minute? No, please stay. No, no, no sit down. It's Don't just... worry about it, Neville. I'll be right back. Oh my gosh. <laughs> she doesn't know what the hell's going on other than he's found out that she's on a date and he's being an asshole. Are you out of your mind? What are you doing? 
doing Will here? you just listen to me for I'm a minute? Jealous. I thought that I was your benevolent No, aside. I'm not jealous. Listen, Jenny. I mean, I'm sure he's a little jealous. What? I'm the Rocketeer. The Rocket who? <laughs> she doesn't even know. <laughs> Give me one good reason why I should believe any of this. Because if anything ever happened to you, I'd go out of my mind. I swear I would. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> good. I'm glad. Oh God. He's caught on. This is bad. Fucking hell, this guy is creepy. <gasps> oh my god, that was close. <laughs> oh god! Oh no, 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 no! <laughs> this is ridiculous. Oh shit. Oh. oh! Classic. Oh shit. Oh my god, he's ruining the entire restaurant. It's the flying man. It's the rocketeer. He's like, yes, folks, it's me. Hello. <laughs> Carry on now. Carry on. Have a nice night. <laughs> It's a classic girl move. Come up from behind, smash him with something. <laughs> Ooh. It's too late. What are you shooting at? Get out, Jenny, get out. Oh shit. Let's just hope Neville doesn't find you. Oh boy. God, he's creepy. Oh my god, Chlor. I don't know what this guy's deal is, but he's a motherfucker. You said that to Greta Garbo, Napoleon's mistress. <laughs> she caught him. He is becoming very predictable, and she is a very smart girl. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Why does he have just women's clothes in his wardrobe? Oh, hell yeah. Oh my gosh, it's... <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Yes, girl. Get it. <laughs> Acting skills, 10,000. Good, get some help. <gasps> oh shit speaking german oh my god he is a nazi oh shit oh my god an american nazi he's not uh he's not american sorry he's clearly english <laughs> Last thing he needs. But adding a rudder to the helmet, that was ingenious. Oh, nothing to it, Howard. Just basic aviation. That's pretty cool that they're discussing aviation together. Good to see you, son. Keep watching, kid. Cost a man's life to get this out of Germany. Oh my god. Nazis on jetpacks to invade America. Holy shit. Oh my god. Where's my of course? You gotta let me use it one more time. <laughs> I'm trying to squid into it, you kid. I can slap you with the Valentine gang has only hired muscle. They're working for a Nazi agent. Someone god. we think is highly placed in Hollywood society. Someone our intrepid G men have been unable to identify. He knows exactly. What? Yes. It's Neville Sinclair. 
Oh my god, it's really not that far fetched. <laughs> Why are the feds so disbelieving? Oh my gosh, he, he really knows how to escape very well. <laughs> Here's the rocket man, rocketeer. It's gonna be really bad if they get their hands on it. Oh yeah, they don't want to, him to just fly out of there with her. What's it like working for a Nazi, Eddie? Huh? They pay you in dollars or Deutschmarks? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ask him about the Germans on the radio. Relax, Frankenstein. You ain't bulletproof. <laughs> Frankenstein. <laughs> Shut up! I'm paying you well. Does it matter who I work for? Uh, to me. yeah, dude. This is war. I not make an honest buck. But I'm 100% American. Mm -hmm. and I don't work for no two-bit Nazi. Good. Let it go. Oh, yes! Fuck you, Nazis! Oh! I don't know what he said, but it, that sounded bad. Yep, that's bad. Nazi backup? Where the fuck did they all come from? Oh, my... Oh, it's, it's, uh, Howard Hughes and the gang. <laughs> Is it? Maybe not. It's the whole of Luxembourg in that, in that, uh, <laughs> blip. Is it a blip? I don't know. Happy Valentine's Day. What? Is he going to shoot him? Oh. Made me think he was going to shoot him. Oh. oh shit. Oh fuck. Ouch. Oh yes! Go Eddie! Yes, Eddie! Well, at least they don't have help anymore. It's just the three of them. Where's the rocket? The rocket will come to us. Oh my god. Look, he's not wrong. <laughs> right next to the fence. The funny sight. <laughs> oh shit! Go get him, kid. <laughs> For America. Oh, uh oh. Uh oh, that's not safe. Dude, you're you're trying to save your girlfriend, not kill her. Oh no, he lost his gun. For fuck's sakes. Oh, he lost his hat. <laughs> Oh my god. This guy is literally Frankenstein. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> He's like, no, don't say that. <gasps> oh shit! Oh my god. Uh, I'm not pilot, but you shouldn't have your windows open when you're that high up in the air. <laughs> Oh yeah. Hand over the rockets or I'll blow her brains. All over the cabin. No. Oh, suddenly he has a German accent? He was he was acting English the whole time. He really is a good actor. Oh good, 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 good. Take off the gum. Oh! <laughs> Oh, oh my god, wow! Damn! Oh, he does his own stunts! <laughs> no, it's not a wig. <laughs> oh, yep. At least now we know. Fire extinguishers did exist. 
Oh yes, a gun! Perfect! Get it, girl! Oh no, oh no, oh no! Oh no! Oh, this is bad. Oh no. The gasoline's like leaking as well. Holy shit. Oh boy. Oh fuck, this is terrible. This is bad. Everything about you is a lie. It wasn't lies, Jen. It was acting. <laughs> oh fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh yeah. I'll miss Hollywood. Yeah. Well, you're gonna die. So, I'm sure you will. Oh, ho, ho! yes. Okay, now, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh shit. How fitting. What a fitting death. Also, Hollywood land. It's weird. Oh, she said it. Okay, they need parachutes. Pronto. Oh my god, this motherfucker never dies. Oh yeah, he's Frankenstein. He is undead. Oh my god, fuck off. <laughs> Dude, that's so dangerous. And Frankenstein's locked onto the hydrogen. What's it called? Hydrogen vehicle thing? I don't know. Floaty, whatever. Oh, bye, bitch. Bye. Bye. Oh. <laughs> Finally. God, I hate that asshole. Hell yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Jump, jump, jump. Oh my God. Thank God. Thank God. Oh, oh shit. That's so close, man. Hell yeah. Howard Hughes to the rescue. <laughs> Yes! Burn that Nazi flag down! <laughs> ...was killed in the tragedy when flaming debris fell on his touring car. That's terrible. That was a nice car. <laughs> so they not telling everybody that uh, he was a Nazi? Oh. I hope he gets to be with his uh, love from five or six years ago. She's a beauty, Mr. Hughes. She? Great big beauty. Another month she'll be ready for the national. Oh, what? Oh my god, is he gonna gift this to them? Oh my gosh. I've been meaning to ask you, what was it like strapping that thing to your back and flying like a bat out of hell? <laughs> oh. It was the post I'll ever get to heaven, Mr. Hughes. Well, well. Maybe not. This girl, she's heaven. Yeah. That shot confirms it. <laughs> oh, please give him a plane. <gasps> oh, yes. I fucking knew it. I knew he was going to gift. I knew he was going to gift it to, her, to him. It's a good thing to have friends in high places. Now he doesn't need to do, to do that clown bullshit or that rocketeer bullshit either. <laughs> Okay, so why'd you say it was for me? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, my prince. Would that you drink of my lips. Thanks. I don't mind if I do. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Take a look at this here. Here, look. Um, do you mind, dude? Uh, we're kind of making out. <laughs> Just favoring a few. <laughs> Hey, Goose, you want to take... <laughs> oh, <laughs> poor PV. Poor PV. I hope he gets to have some romance in his life too. That was such a fun film and I cannot believe I never even heard of the title up until this week. So thank you so much to 
Whoever recommended me to watch this film, I can't even remember. I just saw it in the comment section and I was like, okay, I'll give it a go. So uh, I, I really enjoyed that and I'm so glad I watched it. There was so much adventure. There was actually quite a lot of comedic elements to it too, although comedy wasn't in the genre. I, I feel like I laughed quite a bit in this one. Um, and besides Jennifer Connelly, I didn't recognize any of the actors or actresses. Um, and the only thing comic book E was just Lothar, Lothar's face. <laughs> I just had a look at what Lothar looked like in the comic books and I definitely agree that they did a very good job at trying to make him look as accurate as possible to his comic book version. Um, I think that the pacing was really good. I was even impressed by the green screen. Um, for 1991, they did a pretty good job. They would have used the green screen quite a lot for this one, considering Cliff Secord would jetpack at every single given chance. <laughs> he, was, he was like addicted to that jetpack. At one point I was like, this dude is never going to give it back. Um, but at the same time, he really just wanted to do the right thing and he wasn't going to let anything bad happen to Jenny. I think Jennifer Connelly and Billy Campbell had really great on-screen chemistry, but the chemistry that I loved the most was definitely between Alan Arkin and Billy Campbell. I think uh, their friendship was just so great to watch on screen. Uh, PV the character was just amazing. I really wish he got a little bit more backstory about him, especially when he was talking about the one that got away. And um, I was waiting for him to just kind of like explain a little bit, but it just, it, that was it. And I was like, oh, okay. All right then. I definitely did not see that plot twist in the end with Neville Sinclair, him being the Nazi. <laughs> was like, whoa, what the heck? Because, you know, you don't suspect that from a Hollywood movie star, especially the third most popular Hollywood movie star in America. <laughs> Timothy Dalton. Yeah, I'd never heard of him before up until literally yesterday. I thought that he was playing Inigo Montoya. He looked so similar to that guy from The Princess Bride, because I don't actually know how old The Princess Bride's story is. I know the film came out in the 80s, but in terms of the actual story, I actually have no idea when that was set and when it was made. Um, but yeah, it was it was a really fun movie. I really, really enjoyed it. Let me know what you thought of this film in the comment section below. Do give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. It really helps my channel out. Uncut version is on Patreon. Subscribe for more content like this. Take care of yourselves, guys, and I will see you in my next one. Bye, everyone.